The new year has brought in an influx of people to the gyms of KW. Staying fit and exercising has always been one of the most popular New Year resolutions. Chris Carmichael, the general manager for Crunch Fitness, says that January is their busiest month. Well, at the best of times when you join a gym, most people, you're lucky if you get 30% uh, usage out of things. Uh, traditionally in our industry, if you sign up in the months of December, January and February, you have an 8% chance of succeeding long term. The regulars at the gym say that fitness stations are always filled with people in the first two months, but a number of people quit in March. Stuart Tao, a two-year member of Crunch Fitness, talks about why the numbers reduce at the gym. Like for me, being here for so long, it kind of sucks because now there's more people, like it's more packed. But I know that it's going to be like empty soon anyways because like people don't really stick to their New Year's resolutions or goals or whatever. So they'll come for like the month and then they'll just take off and instead of now have more space to myself again. Travis Albastiel, the district manager for Anytime Fitness, talks about how they touch base with people who are no longer members. The people that do drop off, we do reach out to them and make sure that they keep accountable to their goals. Individual capacity and motivation is said to be the key to success for gym resolutions. With 2018 comes new fitness goals. It is seen that people with a drive are the ones that tend to succeed and stay. For Spoke TV, I'm Varsha Sriganesh.